Between the years of 1932 and 1942, educational borders were being broken within the Osiris Indian Band. Under the direction of Chief Baptiste George, a school was constructed on reserve so the community wouldn't have to send their children away to residential schools. It was Chief George's dream that his people's children could learn about Canada's expanding culture within the context of their own heritage. In 1932, Anthony Walsh was hired by Chief Baptiste George to take over teaching at the Incomeep Day School. Walsh, born in Paris, France, was of Irish descent and grew up in Scotland and England. He had previously taught for a year at Six Mile Creek Indian School near Vernon and had a budding interest in Aboriginal culture. As a teacher, Walsh was special in that he had a heightened sense of understanding and tolerance for the time period. At the time, it was rare for white teachers to be respectful to the native way of life. Walsh, on the other hand, encouraged the children to embrace their own heritage, and it was that encouragement that would eventually lead the children of the Incomeep Day School to create beautiful works of art.